the wait is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. It's Benfica and they take on Barcelona. It's coming up live next on EA TV. It is something very special indeed to make it to a UEFA Champions League final. Now these two teams intent upon tasting glory. Welcome to the showpiece event on the European club calendar. Derek Ray here on the commentary position, joined tonight for live coverage by the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. It's Benfica versus Barcelona. Good evening. What a pleasure it is to be here with you, Derek, sitting over this magnificent stadium with arguably the best two teams well obviously the best two teams in this competition this year because they're in the final and what a final we've got the pitch looks fantastic the crowd are expecting there's the trophy just sitting there and the players in the tunnel just about to do what they do best go out and play and entertain us So we can check on the starting lineup. If you like wingers, you'll love this league. Yeah, absolutely. I love to watch a winger play, especially with pace and power. The central strike will stay more or less in front of the goal. The support will be provided by the three central midfield players. The back four is pretty conventional, but the fullbacks will be asked to support from behind. This is what we expect from the Blaugrana. Marc-André Ter Stegen starts in goal. Mats Hummel starts alongside Samuel Umtiti in the middle of the defence. Arturo Vidal plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And Luis Suarez will be the main striker here. now in the Champions League final we're about to find out which team is the best in Europe and when you consider the level of talent within the Barcelona squad Lee it's no surprise that they're back in a Champions League final no, it's just the... and playing it through the defence and now it is there for him a brisk start and a quick goal. Well, the manager would have said, keep it tight at the back and see if we can nick an early goal. And they certainly have done. Well, as they see, there'll be an inquest between keeper and defenders. He'll be saying, where were you? And they'll be saying, why didn't you catch it? And a bit more analysis as regards the goal. nil then Ivan Rakitic tremendous intuition to win it back well he's opened up the defence here and Zivkovic didn't quite do enough he's having quite the game for himself save after save after save a 
Barcelona always fully expect to be at the business end of the UEFA Champions League but that doesn't mean that the group stage game a really sumptuous ball will there be a tangible end product now Busquets Barcelona have lost possession On the ball, Luis Suarez. Lionel Messi. So after that, a goal kick it'll be. possession Benfica quick thinking to dispossess his opponent Barcelona have been awarded the throw in and now Coutinho excellent challenge an incisive pass he has teammates to play it to Opportunity knocks. Terrific piece of goalkeeping from the German there. Goalkeeping at its best. Corner kick played over. Clattered away. Maneuvering his way forward. And the oh, he's knocking on the door. Oh, he's found the net. And that increases the advantage to two. Just what they wanted and just what they deserve. Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. So 2-0 now. Rakitic on the ball. Ivan Rakitic. Andrija Zivkovic. Promising looking ball. And the flag has gone up here. Offside the decision. Goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Targets available, cross comes in. Oh, quite simply, the cross was too close to the keeper. Not a particularly strong challenge. Still possibilities. Much more straightforward for the keeper this time, but previously he had work to do. Well, double bubble. He gets the ball in the end, but the first save he makes, absolutely brilliant. Rakitic on the ball. Suarez. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. Rakitic. Great in possession then, Coutinho. And now, passing it through. Super goalkeeping, it was one against one. Oh, I really fancy the attacker there to go round him, but it's brilliant goalkeeping in the end. He's in with a chance. Well, a corner right on the back of the last one.
played into the centre of the box. Well, a sloppy clearance. What can the up? And that is that for the first half in this Champions League final. And my goodness, Lee, did we think it would be so lopsided. Well, I didn't. And there's one team very happy in that dressing room and the other one very, very down. But you've got to now play for pride. Come on. You've got families in the stand watching this. You've got to pull your socks up and try and make this second half a little bit more competitive. And they're underway now in the Champions League final. We're about to find out which team is... And playing it through the defence. And now it is there for him. He has teammates to play it to. Opportunity knocks. Terrific piece of goalkeeping from the German there. Goalkeeping at its best. Maneuvering his way forward. And the block. Oh, he's knocking on the door. Oh, he's found the net. And that increases the advantage to two. Just what they wanted and just what they deserve. And now passing it through. Super goalkeeping, it was one against one. Oh, I really fancy the attacker there to go round him, but it's brilliant goalkeeping in the end. Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. An abundance of space. And the defender takes care of business. Lionel Messi. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. opportunistically when you're chasing a game two goals down you've got to take chances like that Derek whatever way you slice it a good night's work for this fellow so far Lee well, he's looked really sharp out there. Scored a goal, hit the woodwork, played really, really well. Tremendous ball played through. And the ball is in the net. The crowd have gone crazy, and quite rightly so. What a finish that is. Well, look at it again. I do question the defenders, but let's give credit to him. What a wonderful solo effort. And he still has the presence of mind to finish it off. What a brilliant solo goal. There has been a gulf in quality tonight but you've really got to give them credit for the fact that they haven't let up at all. It's with Lars Bender. Given away by Barcelona. Running towards goal. One man to beat. Will he? Well, he saw the whites of the keeper's eyes and the whites of his outstretched gloves. Great goalkeeping. Well, he's denied a certain goal there. Great reflexes from the keeper. And a deep ball in, and clears his lines. 
The crossbar got in the way. On the ball, Lars Bender. Well, he'd be looking at that and thinking, how did he not score? I'm not so sure either, Derek. Speculative. Oh, what a goal! A tremendous strike. Hard to believe that he elected to take on that shot. Absolutely brilliant. Let's have a look at this replay. Caught the keeper on his heels, and this is why. Short back lift, great strike, takes everybody by surprise. And the goal that was scored, well worth another look, Lee. Sadly, we have to conclude that this hasn't really been a contest, but all credit to any side committed to scoring goals like this. Sergio Busquets has lost it. And here's Busquets. Well, it's a poor tackle. And now Suarez. Rakitic. He has time to play it over. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Well, it's come down to the final 20 minutes here. And for more on the injury, let's go down to our reporter, Jeff Shreves. Oh, there's some real concern looks from the bench, I have to tell you. Now, this might pay dividends. And even Ter Stegen might wonder how on earth he got there. Well, he's given a corner, the referee. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. And now the delivery. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Over the touchline for a throw-in. Well, let's see, does he mean business? To Stegen with a great save. A corner will ensue. And firing it into the area. The keeper really had work to do after that header came in. Marks out a 10 for the save, Lee. I'll give him an 8. No, 7. Now Busquets. Barcelona moving the ball swiftly and finding themselves in a promising position. Options in the centre. Will there be a tangible end product? Can they convert? And a goal it is from who else? Lionel Messi. Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. And a bit more analysis as regards the goal. Goals and plentiful supply. 4-1 currently. PC. Gabriel. Well, let's make no bones about it. This is a thorough thrashing, Lee. Well, how frustrated do a set of players look? And quite rightly so. These Barcelona players look down on their knees. They've been poor tonight. Let their standards drop. Inexcusable, really. Back to the drawing board next week on the training ground. No way back from here for me. And the ball is in the net. 
The crowd have gone crazy, and quite rightly so. What a finish that is. Well, let's take a look at this replay. The difference between a good player and some of the best players is they don't need to take a touch. Gets his shot away. First time. Nothing else matters but concentrating on that ball. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Just a couple of minutes left for play. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. time and the issue has been settled one team crestfallen the other jubilantly well there's winners and there's always losers fine margins between the two expectation wins nothing Derek you've got to go out there and seize the moment and for these players well it's the night of their lives and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, you have to enjoy it because it passes so quickly. And they know what comes next, the presentation of the cup with the big ears. Well, you just think how many games he played this season as well. All that's in the past now. The game that's just happened was the most important one. They're all poised. The Champions League winners in 2019. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. Well, this is the moment I love sharing it with the fans, ticker tapes coming down, the families in the stand giving them all away. Well, they've travelled all over Europe watching this team. Now they get to share in this moment. Fantastic. Well, it took fire as well as ice on the pitch. Now the chance for a photograph. My mum always told me to get on the front row. She taught you well, Lee. There we have it. The Champions League victors for 2019. And playing it through the defence. And now it is there for him. Maneuvering his way forward. And the block. Oh, he's knocking on the door. Oh, he's found the net. And that increases the advantage to two. Just what they wanted and just what they deserve. Well, he's looked really sharp out there. Tremendous ball played through. And the ball is in the net. The crowd have gone crazy and quite rightly so. What a finish that is. Will there be a tangible end product? Can they convert? And a goal it is from who else? Lionel Messi. And the ball is in the net. The crowd have gone crazy and quite rightly so. What a finish that is.